Well, Friday's massacre has moved the gun control debate back into the national spotlight. And it's caused some major retailers to pull a certain model of rifle off their shelves, at least temporarily. WEMY TV's Candace Cole checked to see how a popular local store is reacting and joins us live in the studio. Candace. Renata, some gun manufacturers are taking a hit, but a lot of stores are selling more guns lately. And locally, it appears to be pretty much business as usual at Hesselson's in Elmira Heights. Since Friday's horrific attack on the Sandy Hook Elementary School in Newtown, Connecticut, share prices for gun makers like Smith & Wesson and Sturm Ruger & Company have seen a significant drop on Wall Street. Now, Freedom Group Inc., the company which owns Bushmaster Firearms International, is being sold after coming under public scrutiny. Major retailers are taking popular rifles off the market. Dick's Sporting Goods temporarily took one of the most popular semi-automatic rifles off its shelves as a sign of respect to the victims. And Walmart pulled information about the same rifle, the Bushmaster 223, off its website. It's the model Adam Lanza used in the massacre. However, smaller rifle retailers like Hesselson's have no intention of halting gun sales. While they sympathize with the victims' families, they say the guns themselves are not the problem. There's other factors involved in what, in what happens, so I don't think by just eliminating gun sales is going to eliminate what happened. So at this point, uh, we don't plan on eliminating uh, selling those firearms. So. According to a CBS News poll, support for stricter gun control is at a 10-year high. Live in the studio, Candace Cole, WENY-TV News.